हेलो स्टूडेंट टुडे वी आर गोइंग टू स्टार्ट आवर चैप्टर नंबर फोर रेवोल्यूशन ऑफ कम्युनिकेशन हाउ कम्युनिकेशन स्टार्टेड द कम्युनिकेशन इन्वॉल्व बींग इन टच विथ अदर थ्रू स्पीकिंग राइटिंग रीडिंग और ट्रेवलिंग मीन्स कम्युनिकेशन मीन्स इफ वी आर इन टच विद अदर्स वाइल वी स्पीक टू अदर्स talk to others with the help of writing while we write something to someone or reading reading is also common in communication or traveling the written or painted records of early humans tells a lot about them the early records written records and paintings on the caves tells a lot about them how they communicate development in the use of numbers and writing led to the progress of the early humans means after they developed the use of numbers and writings then their their progress is going well at the good speed so why is the need for writing the need for writing is anything that is in writing can be preserved for a long time if we write something we can save it for a long time moreover writing records are like evidence which enables a lot of understanding and progress if we write something another person learns from that writing also oral message or information can erased from the memory if someone tells something orally we can forget it in day or two day or in a month but if it is written somewhere we can read it again and again and memorize it however written words remains they can even be used for research purposes if it is written somewhere we can research it the drawings painting and writing of the early humans reveals a lot of correct information about them the early human write something and from that writing records we get a lot of information about them from their writings initially the early humans made drawings and painting on the walls of the caves they draw on the wall of the caves where they live then they start using symbols which led to the development of the scripts what is the script a script is the written form means a script is a written or a written document in the written form the earliest form of writing was developed by the sumerians sumerian are the early humans who developed the form of writing it had wedge shaped words and symbols and was called confu form cuneiform that writing is called cuneiform egyptian used a symbol of pictures writing called hieroglyphics in india the people of the indus valley civilization used the oldest script the script is not That that script is not deciphered. Deciphered मतलब decoded. We can't decode it. Means we can't even read it from that time to yet. Brahmin script come next. After that Brahmin script come, and the Devanagari script is based on sound. And the Devanagari sound, uh, Devanagari script is based on sound. now the use of numbers the early human used pebbles and sticks for counting even their fingers later counting on fingers become popular after that they used their finger to counting and it become popular with the passage of time various ways of writing numbers come into existence
द सुमेरियंस यूज स्पेशल शेप ऑफ काउंटिंग इन सिक्सटीज द रोमन नंबर सिस्टम वॉज डेवलप बाय द रोमन्स एंड द रोमन्स डेवलप द रोमन नंबर द नंबर सिस्टम दैट इज इन यूज टूडे वॉज डेवलप्ड इन इंडिया that we are using the number system that number system was developed in india the hindu arabic system was taken by the arabs to europe the hindu arabic numbers that we are using today nowadays is taken arabs to europe moreover the concept of zero was also india's gift to the world that zero is uh, discovered by our india use of pigeons people used the pigeons for communication in olden days people used pigeons to send letters to peoples living at far off places people realized that homing pigeons had the ability to fly back to their homes they get the idea that pigeons have the ability to get back to their homes so they fly the, their pigeon with that letter to the particular place after dropping the letter the pigeon came back to their home people train their pigeon to use them as a means of communication briefly written messages were tied to the legs of the pigeon and then flew away to deliver them then they flew away the pigeon and uh, pigeon delivered that letter to the particular place communication in olden days with the help of pigeon and horses moreover for now very far off places people rode on horses with the message in their hand such way of communication continues for nearly 3000 year till the 20th century so student that's all for today next Uh, invention of telephone and telegraph we will discuss in our next class so students thanks thank you for listening thank you